Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Today, William Ruto was addressing the residents in Muranga County. And I was shocked. The video that I watched, I want to display it so that you can understand. People are just watching William Samaruto and listening to him as they are like watching a scarecrow. Because this man is always after, after promises. This man is after fooling the residents in Mount with the knowledge that he is still having the ground in Mount Kenya region. I want you to watch the video. You will be shocked because, because people are, ju are just watching him. I just, I don't know, you could even get the picture that even William Ruto and regarding Ashago and other leaders are addressing, addressing the residents. These residents are not happy at all. Those promises, they promised these residents during electioneering period are the same, same promises that they are coming up with today. I want you to watch the video, but before you watch the video, ladies and gentlemen, if you are a visitor for the first time and you have not subscribed to this channel, please do me a favor, ensure you subscribe to this channel. You put on the notification bell that when I upload my videos like this, you get notified automatically by YouTube. For those who have not liked this video, please don't forget to like this video. Otherwise, watch the video, then we continue. <laughs> Na lazima tuwe na mpango kamili. Ndiyo muliona katika hii budget ya nye tumetengeneza juzi. Na mimi na washikuru watu wa moranga. Muli nipatia kijana. Anaitua ndindi nyoro. Ndiya amenisaidia kupanga mambo ya budget. Ndiya muna nielewa? Yeye ndiya amepanga hile esabu yote ambayo hiko kwa budget. Na katika hiyo esabu nilimuambia huyu kijana. Ya kwamba lazima tuwe na mpango ya housing. Housing hapa moranga, tunataka kujenga nyumba kati ya elfu ishirini na nyumba elfu telatini. Na tunataka vijana ambao watatusaidia kufanya hiyo kazi. Na tayari tuko na mahali ya kujenga hizo manyumba. Tunaitaji vijana elfu telatini wa moranga, wataka utusaidia kwa mpango ya housing. Nyenye vijana muko? Vijana wa moranga muko? Mumesikia ni vile nimesema? Nimesema, tunaitaji vijana elfu telatini wakutusaidia katika mpango ya housing wapate ya jira. Na kwa sababu tulisema kazi ni kazi. Wera ni wera. Kazi ikipatikana ya plumbing simutafanya. Ya electrician simutafanya. Na ya carpenter simutafanya. Na ya mason simutafanya. Na ile kazi ngine hote mutafanya. Ama nyinyi ni wale wakuchagua jembe. Situlisema wera ni wera Ama ni aje Muko tayari Wangwana wa muranga muko tayari Ya pili nime, Tumeweka katika budget Kila ward Tunaweka ICT hub Maali vijana Wataenda kusomeshwa Vile watafanya ajira Katika mtandao Na ndio sababu tunazungusha Mambo ya fiber optic Kilomita elfu miyamoja Kenya Vijana mujipange kila ward tumekubaliana na hao wabunge wabunge watahakikisha there is a ICT hub in every ward ndio tupange ajira hawa vijana vijana muko tayari muko tayari computer itawashinda kufinya eh itawashinda na tutakuwa na walimu wa kuwafundisha so hiyo kazi yote tumepanga kwa sababu lazima tupange ajira ya vijana wa taifa letu la Kenya hatuwezi kuendelea katika taifa ambayo vijana wetu wanaangaika na nyinyi watu wa boda boda niko na maneno yenu vile vile si niliwaambia tutawashughulikia sasa kuanzia mwezi ujao mwezi wa tisa sasa tutaanza mpango ya kubadilisha hizi pikipiki zenu hii pikipiki ya kutumia petroli sasa tutawapatia pikipiki inatumia stima na bei yake itakuwa bei ya chini kupunguza gharama ya wale wanaosafiri na pia wewe upate pesa ya kutosha kwa mfuko. Sasa hii unatumia petroli karibu shilingi 400 kila siku. Sasa utakuwa ni shi, unatumia shilingi 100 kwa stima. Sasa mambo yako itakuwa sawa sawa. Nyinyi watu wa boda muko tayari? Muko tayari? Watu wa boda muko area? 
Hebu nione watu wa boda ambao wako hapa wako area bus very good. Mtaendelea na hiyo. Ya mwisho tumekubaliana ya kwamba tunabadilisha Now, ladies and gentlemen, do you still trust William Samuruto when it comes to his promises? Because when you look at these promises, these are things he told Mount Kenya residents. Kwani hizi vitu ni mpya? Is a man that is always after promises. And I want to say without any fear of contradiction. You like it or you don't like it. William Ruto together with Ndindi Nyoro, Kimani Shungwa, Rigathi Gashago and the brigades in Kenya Kwanza, they will continue fooling Mount Kenya region as they have always realized that Mount Kenya region is easy to fool them. That is whatever they are doing. Because if it was Kisi region, if it was Western, you could have been told, you know, but even despite of the Mount Kenya residents are not coming out to tell the truth is that they are frustrated. They are not comfortable. In fact, the efforts that William Ruto is putting in his leadership to ensure that he's not going to lose the support in Mount Kenya region is just a kind of malicious things. You are the president. The DPT is coming from the, that, those areas. You have the person who represents the budget, the budget committee. In fact, Neri Nyoro is the chair, person of budget committee in National Assembly. You have the majority leader, uh, Kimani Shungwa. Still, Munapana Magari na Jitokeza Juna, still like your campaign. You have the instrument of powers. You have all things that you need to deliver to the people. But what you are seeing today is just still a campaign. These people are embarked to serious campaign as if tomorrow we are going to another election. But since this is something that we are used to. William Ruto is a man of promises. And don't forget, the only thing that they're going to do in Mount Kenya region is campaigning. These people are not going to do any kind of development there. Because today, William Ruto came out launching a certain project in Gidurai. It's called Gidurai Market. That market was for Uhuru Magai Kenyatta. It was Uhuru who came out building that Gidurai market. Musidanganyue. Now, Ruto is coming out to open that market. Alavu munambiwa ati Ruto ndi amejenga yo market. Wakati ilugwe na jengwa, he was busy rejecting Uhuru Magai Kenyatta. So, kwani Ruto amekua kuungozi karibu miaka moja? Just one year. Na hiyo soko ni kubwa kwani ilijengwa siku gani? Let us stop lying to Kenyans. That get the right market that William Ruto opened today is not the development of William Ruto. It is the development of Uhuru Muigai Kenyatta during his regime. And remember when Uhuru Kenyatta was busy building that market, William Ruto was going across the Republic of Kenya and also including the right saying that Uhuru Kenyatta was misusing the funds. Uru Kenyatta was not delivering, you know. Now you're coming back, launching and opening the market in your name, saying that you are the one that has, of course, built that market. It is not you. It is the project that was built under the handshake regime. William Ruto was busy going across the Republic of Kenya, spreading the ideologies and agendas, hustler nation narrative against Uru Mugay Kenyatta. So these projects you are listening to the Kenya Kwanza government coming out to tell Kenyans that they are going to launch, you know, that they are going to launch development in Mount Kenya region. Forget that. Since William Ruto took power, he has done nothing in Mount Kenya region. Take it to the bank. He came out promising Mira market in Somali. As we speak now, yesterday I watched a news where people in Meru complaining that even... They are frustrated. They are leaving the, 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 the business of Mira. When you look at coffee, tea, and milk, the other day I analyzed a video here. Mount Kenya residents are complaining. They are being lied to. Ninini William Ruta Shafanya Mount Kenya region. Just count at the comment section below. Nothing. When it comes to bursaries, what wana finyana bursaries, what wana pesa Mount Kenya region. When it comes to Boda Boda, Mamamboga, 
This man has done nothing. So it's just to consolidate Mount Kenya region so that he can be re-elected in the next election 2027. So William Ruto does not have any agenda of development in Mount Kenya region. You like it or you don't like it. That is William Ruto. So this meeting in Sagana, these rallies in Mount Kenya region, these are just fake kind of rallies. You know, you are the president. You were elected just a year ago. You are embarked to serious campaigns for what purpose? You have the money, you have the, the resources. Give people development. Stop giving them promise after promises. It will not give us a good idea when it comes to the leadership of William Samaruto. So ladies and gentlemen, what are your thoughts? Drop your opinion at the comment section below. Otherwise, I want to appreciate you so much because of your support. Please consider liking this video. When you like this video, you automatically support this video. And don't forget also to share and give your opinion at the comment section below. Otherwise, bye-bye till you meet on another video.